Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm making a carrot cake loaf. So today we have carrots, eggs, sugar, brown cinnamon, baking soda, salt, vegetable oil, and you can add vanilla extract eggs and chopped pecans and raisins. So here I grated up some carrots. Inside I have some granola with raisins some peanuts i blend that up in the blender to get it as finely as possible and yeah we about to mix 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 i'm fixing it up because i forgot to plug it in so yeah we about to get that right we about to blend baby blend <laughs> yes get it right get it right yeah look at them things fly <laughs> they got a great consistency it was just grinding it to, you know, put the oven on 350. And this is all the ingredients inside. Now we're going to begin to blend and make sure everything is incorporated the right way so that we don't leave nothing behind. Look at them carrots and raisins and peanuts and granola, all that stuff together. And we're just going to mix and mix. I continue to blend to make sure that everything was nice and smooth. So that's what we're just going to do. Let this continue to mix so that way, you know, everything's incorporated the right way so that we don't have no lumps and that it cooks up nicely because who wants a lumpy cake? Nobody. <laughs> yes, definitely nobody wants a lumpy cake. So, yeah, we're going to continue to mix. Okay, after we done mixed it all up, now I'm about to get ready to pour it in the pan. There's a little excess oil there, but it's fine. It's going to just cook into the cake. Like, a little bit of extra oil will not hurt. But look at that joint. That pour is just, whoo, beautiful, right? I think in this one, it's a little lighter than I did the last time. I should have added just a little bit more brown sugar, but, you know... We're going to see how it cooks up. We make sure we got the size with the spatula just scrape, scrape, scrape. Yeah, honey, because that's what we got to do. Make sure we get all the cake. No cake left behind. Okay. Look at all them carrots. And now I'm about to just smooth it out so that it's not lumpy. And we get an even texture and it's not, like, you know, unleveled. Now I'm about to put it in the oven. I'm checking on it. It's cooking up nicely. And here, you guys, here is the finished product. We have successfully made a carrot cake loaf. Thanks for watching.